David Joswick is the executive director of the New Hope for Kids, which is the reason why we're having the mascot games here in Orlando, Florida. This is their facility. They had a press conference party tonight for the families and kids. And then they're going to have the actual mascot games at the Amway Arena in Orlando. And it's a great event with all these different mascots around the country. David, what is it about this event? What is it doing? It's helping New Hope for Kids, but explain about the mascot games and what it is helping. Well, New Hope for Kids and, and part of their Get Well program with families and Wish Families and Grief Families is family events. So we, we do a number of family events, eight to ten family events every year. And it's an opportunity to network and, and for these families to socialize. So, the mascot games, I, I, I don't, I wasn't involved when they were put together, but I can tell you our attitude toward them over the years has been, it's a great community event. And we don't want to just have it for New Hope for Kids families, we want to share it throughout the community. And that's how we uh, got involved with the sports commission that took us to the old Amway Center, and now we're in the new Amway Center. and. We, uh, it, it, it's unique, it's a one, a kind of, one kind of event, and we want kids throughout the community to enjoy it, and um, it's expensive to put it on, but we, we, we are able to uh, draw attendance. Typically each year, 18 to 19,000 participated. This year, we're, we've been working hard to try to get that number over 20,000. So after tomorrow, we'll have a good idea of how close we are to that 20,000 level. But it's just, you know, kids, families, everybody enjoys fun outings where you can put a smile on your face and laugh and enjoy and have a good time. And this is unique. And uh, uh, we're fortunate that, uh, and the mascots love it. We're fortunate we can put it on. Uh, but the mascots enjoy it. They enjoy the interaction with the kids. They like, they like the idea of the camaraderie. It's really a win-win. It's a win for the mascots. It's a win for the charity. It's a win for kids and families in the community. It's, and it's a win really for the community. I'm still not done selling the community on this as a, as a community event and get more uh, sponsorship support for it. But I think that's coming. You know. Tell us about New Hope for Kids. Well, New Hope for Kids... It is, has a mission which consists of two programs. It, it consists of a, a wish program that uh, a child that has a, uh, a, a medical condition where a physician says this child uh, in all probability is not going to live into adulthood and, and signs a statement stating, stating such, that child then is eligible for a wish. And in, in our program, the, the children list three wishes that they would like to have, you know, one, two, three, and we try to honor one of those wishes in the order of preference um, for the child and the family. And the wishes are all types of wishes. Um, I mean, from uh, cruises to um, visiting uh, uh, parts of the country to have you know, trips to uh, having uh, specialized wheelchairs so they can go on the beach. Uh, it, it's uh, Room makeovers, uh, shopping sprees, uh, it just it goes on and on and on. Um, we try to do 50 wishes a year, we budget for 50 wishes a year, and that's what we try to do is each year. As far as the grief program goes, uh, what we try to do is, is provide an environment where kids can express what they're feeling inside, realize that they're not the only one going through these difficult times, that um, uh, the way they think is not different than the way other, other kids think. They, they really aren't different than other kids. And also that uh, we try to subside because most kids have a fear that somebody else close to them and their family is going to die as well. And death is, is, is notorious. Any, any researcher in the area knows that the deleterious effects can, can affect kids. Forty years after the death, uh, feelings come out. They can come out in ways of anger. They can come out in ways of relationship disruptions. They can come out in ways of depression. 